on my last video we talked about joe rogan getting called out getting attacked by uh donald trump's uh, maga crowd for endorsing rfk you a fan yeah i am a fan yeah he's the only one that makes sense to me probably didn't like that here's what donald trump said let me see if i could do the voice it would be it would be very interesting to see how loudly joe Rogan gets booed the next time he enters the ufc ring maga 2024 Joe had to make a statement saying that I didn't endorse him. I just said I liked him. So here's a post of Joe clarifying his position on RFK Jr. Uh, Joe Rogan, here's what he says. For the record, this isn't an endorsement. This is me saying that I like RFK Jr. as a person. And I really appreciate the way he discusses things with civility and the intelligence. I think we could use more of that in the world. I also think Trump raising his fist and saying fight after getting shot is one of the most American fucking things of all time. I'm not saying I'm not I'm not the guy to get political information from. If you want if you want that from a comic, go to comic dave smith he actually knows what he's talking about this is joe rogan and donald trump i mean it's not donald trump it's freaking shane gillis as donald trump which is very funny it says ran into trump everything is cool uh you know it's kind of funny and then after that shane as trump attacks calls out joe rogan for being a coward because he had to you know basically make a post saying guys like calm down i didn't endorse him little joe he came in he said he wants to endorse rfk jr can you believe this so here is uh shane gillis as donald trump on kill tony calling out joe rogan joe rogan is an absolute joke and a complete pussy and if i ever saw him i would whoop his bitch ass what a coward joe rogan complete coward and it's frankly is an embarrassment to this country he used to be such a powerful guy. i mean look honestly he probably would say something like that <laughs> what a coward he's scared it to endorse me <laughs> I mean, it's obviously it's been set up, you know, uh, you know, he 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 got the green light from Joe to ba basically mock him there, uh, you know, like just to I guess maybe to calm down the 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 MAGA supporters. What a guy! What a great guy! What a what an amazing American this man is, Joe Rogan. What a true patriot. Great man, I would never say anything negative about this man. <laughs> yep, exactly like Trump, right? Now when they're face to face. What a great guy, big strong man, came up to me, tears in his eyes, said, Joe, he's a great guy. Maybe I had it wrong. What a guy, what a guy. Everybody agrees this is one of the best guys we talk about, we say Austin, Austin, Texas is great. Joe Rogan is great. Frankly, Joe Rogan is the best and everyone knows it. And I love RFK. Who doesn't love RFK? He's a great guy. But anyway, guys, I, I, I enjoyed this little moment here. It just showed maybe some uh, humility from Joe here because it was uh, something that he didn't have to do, quite honestly. He didn't have to post his uh, a statement out for people to understand what he actually said but maybe the maga crowd kind of scares him a little bit and that's why he did it right that's the reason why he did it but props to shane for doing a great impression of uh you know donald trump and uh let me know what you guys think about this like and subscribe and i'll see you guys for another one bye, -bye.